Guys, so we're down here at the Indianapolis Four Wheel Jamboree Nationals in Indianapolis at the State Fairgrounds. Uh, we have Equalizer in the background. I think it's the first time in around 30 years this truck's been here. Big thanks to my dad and Ron for getting it around and bringing it down here, putting it on display for me. I didn't get to work on it like I wanted to. I hurt my back. Just things come up. So it, it ran and drove off the trailer down here just like it did at Raleigh. But uh, we're going to go back to the shop. We're going to wrench on it some more. But it did make it to the Jamboree. We've had a lot of people say they love seeing it. And I think it looks pretty awesome. Big thanks to Mike Vodder Sr. for letting me have this thing this summer. And uh, also, in the background of it, you'll see Todd Lockwood's Invader 1 monster truck. Todd brought his truck and put it on display to represent the Hall of Fame and Museum. And it looks awesome. Hasn't been out many shows this year. We got our 454 SS show truck back down here again. This thing's been at Indy almost every year. It's only missed a couple years since this Jamboree's been going on. We got Katie's Jeep down there, Scrambler, Ford Ranger. And we got the fabulous Ron Maple right there. So anyhow, we're gonna work on Equalizer in the near future. We got a half a dozen things we need to do to make it better. I need to get water hooked to the radiator in the front. It needs a new orbital valve for the steering. It needs an alternator on it. And we need to tune it a little bit so it sets and idles a little better and won't overheat. So that'll be a video coming up. So Ron just did a TikTok about this truck in the background. Our 1990 454 SS factory production 454 SS. I don't know how many they made, but there wasn't a lot of them. They were the fastest production truck at the time or whatever. They only made them in two wheel drive, obviously. And uh, his TikTok blew up. So I thought maybe you guys would like to see this. So obviously it is not stock anymore. It's got around 32 to 35 inches of lift, depending on how you look at it. It now has 54 inch tires on it. I bought those from my father for a gift four years ago, I think. It had 44s on it for almost 30 years. And finally, we come up with a set of 54s because it clears 44s and makes them look small. Custom arched leaf springs. That was my father's specialty. Custom solid axles turned so that they have the right geometry for the drive shafts. It is functional four-wheel drive. That is like one of the biggest set of lease rings, by the way, in the country. It's got a Dana 70 HD rear, Dana 70 front, and like I say, it is all functional. Bone stock 454 SS motor. Um, it actually has a tilt bed on it now, which you guys will see at some point. The interior is pretty darn clean in it. It's got some junk in it, but interior is like new in this thing it has like 1300 original miles on it so it's a very low miles truck my dad bought it brand new and uh lifted it however many inches put 44s on it started displaying it at these shows the custom paint got put on it a year or two after uh he lifted it and it's been like this and it's been at this four-wheel jamboree for every bit of 30 years So anyhow, I hope you guys like this thing. We'll show you some more about it at some point. And uh, thanks for watching our channel. Go buy some merch. Make sure you guys subscribe. And uh, we got more stuff coming up. So keep watching.